The name is Finley. I help people understand the world of money. It can change the course of your life. Believe in that and believe in you. Understanding the efficient market hypothesis. Number one, what is known, what is known is already baked in to the market, whether that market's in the United States or someplace outside the United States. Information that is known is already affected the markets. That is the efficient market hypothesis in its simplest form. Number two, the only thing that's going to change those markets is what is not known. What is not known. That is what is going to change any kind of future returns. So, it's important to understand that and understand point number three. We must ignore people who try to predict markets, who try to tell you where to go or not to go with your investment dollars. Because you see, they don't accept the efficient market hypothesis. They want you to think they know something that others don't. Well, that's a mistake. They're delusional and sometimes a crook. So it's very important to understand that this idea of markets moving, they're only going to move when something happens that nobody saw coming. And then number four, we must also realize for ourselves that we don't know what others don't know. Think about that. In other words, we're not any more knowledgeable about what's going to happen in the future of the market just because we think we do. We don't. And we should not get in that game of trying to predict the markets or any kind of sector within the market ourselves. Again, that's delusional. And then finally, number five, there is a solution. And the solution is to own all markets. You do that with no load index mutual funds as you invest in stocks and bonds all over the world at a very, very low cost at a place like Vanguard, for one example. And that is the efficient market hypothesis.